Hi, welcome to another episode of David Rides a Trike. I'm David, and I am riding a trike. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, welcome. I'll give you a short introduction in a moment. If you're familiar with my channel, there's a skip intro link down in the description. Uh, again, for those of you watching for the first time, welcome. I make videos trying to motivate people with chronic illnesses and disabilities to find some fun form of outdoor exercise because doing so can be both therapeutic and fun. Personally, I fall into both the chronically ill and disabled categories. I was diagnosed as a type 1 diabetic when I was a year and a half old. I had a pancreas transplant that cured me of the diabetes when I was 41. I've had three organ transplants in total. I, <coughs> excuse me, I uh, had stage three cancer a few years ago that was successfully treated and cured with uh, surgery and chemotherapy. I am legally blind. I've had all sorts of procedures and maladies that got me stuck in the hospital. I honestly can't remember how many times. And right now I am battling stage four cancer that has spread through a lot of my body. Um, I'm undergoing chemotherapy for that and so far so good. Today I wanted to talk about the differences between riding in riding on a weekday versus riding on a uh, weekend. You know what? I'm going to turn the camera around here because it's really pretty here. Hang on. There we go. Uh, today is a weekday. It's a Wednesday. And one of the things I prefer about riding on the weekdays is the obvious. Um, it's less crowded. And given my vision challenges, that's always a good thing. And because it's less crowded, I can relax a little more, be a little less vigilant as to what is going on out here. And it lets my mind, or it enables my mind to loosen up, just let the thoughts kind of flow wherever they want. And it becomes kind of a meditational experience for me. When I come home, I always feel like I've cleared my head and uh, kind of like I've washed away a lot of the clutter that accumulates up in our brains. Also riding on the weekdays, there are no weekend warriors. And there's nothing wrong with these people. Um, and obviously most people work Monday through Friday and they're out here on the weekends. My only kind of issue is a lot of them come out here and they don't understand or they don't know trail etiquette. Um, they don't know that they should be staying to the right side of the trail, whether they're walking, running, or riding, alerting people when uh, they're passing someone else, stopping in the middle of the trail, things like that, that uh, can, can be a little bit dangerous. So on the weekends, you really have to be a lot more careful and have your eye out for things like this. Now, riding during the weekends does have its benefits. Um, I've met quite a few people out here on my rides 
and typically I run into them on the weekends. And some of them have become friends, really. Some really just acquaintances. We see each other, say hi, might stop and have a few words. But I've become friends with a few of them, and it's, uh, it's nice to run into them. Not physically, of course. And now some of them do come out here on the weekdays, too, um, which is even better. How do you like this section? It's nice, isn't it? And the other thing about riding on the weekends is if something should happen and you need assistance of any kind, whether it's a uh, mechanical with your bike or trike or something physical with you, because there are so many other people, your chances of getting help are uh, greatly enhanced. On the weekdays, as you can see, you can ride a good distance and not see anybody. Today, I, I actually took a note, took note, I was riding on the trail for 1.1 mile before I saw anybody, and uh, that was a woman walking her dog. Whereas Saturday, was it Saturday I was out here? Yeah, I think so. Saturday or Sunday. And it was a beautiful day just like this. And it was quite crowded. And literally in the first two tenths of a mile, I saw six people. So I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but one of the main reasons I do like to ride is, as I said before, just to let my mind go, uh, not have to think about anything. Uh, thoughts just come through out of nowhere. You get sights and sounds and smells that remind you of other times, which is kind of cool. And on the weekends, it doesn't happen as much because you have to have an eye out all the time. So that's really about it. Which do I prefer? I greatly prefer the uh, week days, mainly because of my vision limitations. It's a uh, much more relaxing ride. I'm not worried about uh, people stopped in the middle of the trail when I come around a sharp curve or anything like that. Um, not that I can just not pay attention. Um, I still have to obviously pay attention to the trail and what's up ahead of me, but it, it, it is easier and the ride is significantly more relaxing for me. So yeah, that's it. Let me know what you think down below and I will see you on the next ride. Bye-bye.